Okay, everybody, welcome once again. Um, Cubasis 3 with another update, so 3.3. .3, it comes with advanced MIDI routing. So in this case, I have on track number one, I have the simple MIDI riff, right? What we could do now is send this MIDI to track number two, right? So to do that, you choose track number two, obviously, and then go into routing, inputs, and then choose track number one. Don't worry about don't worry about all this. I'll I'll explain to you what all this is in a second. So choose track number one, right? And now if I play together, so as you can see, that's just um, audio layer. So that's getting this MIDI from. So that's getting the MIDI from track number one. Now what we can do additionally is on track number two, go into MIDI effects load a MIDI effect, in this case, um, Fugue Machine, right? And then I have this simple riff I have in there. Oh yeah, one more thing. <clears throat> if you have MIDI on track number, on any track, and you send that MIDI to a different track, for example, in this case, track two, but if I mute track number one, bear in mind, you're not gonna get um, no MIDI coming through uh, to track number two. Right. So, for example, in this case, you only hear what is coming from Fugue Machine. Right. So, I will show you a workaround in a second. Anyway, so to get the both audio, uh, to get both MIDI from track number one and from Fugue Machine, you need to enable MIDI through in uh, in the MIDI effects. Right. So now, if you play all together. Okay, so now we can also go to track number three, for example, which is just the bass line, and then tell it to get its um, input from track number two. So in this case, so track number three is only getting MIDI from track number two. Bear in mind in Cubasis 3, you can only route one track to another, right? You can't route multiple track. But like I said, there is a workaround. Just stay tuned a second. Okay, so yeah, this is a simple way of routing MIDI in Cubasis. Now we get to the fun part. I'm going to get rid of this MIDI, go into track number one, and set the instrument to no instrument. You go into MIDI effects, and then you load Helium, right? So in this case, I have Helium right here. So MIDI effects, and then you choose Helium, okay? So now in Helium, we go to track number one, right? And then long tap on track number one sets the MIDI bus to one. So you just just by this, the left and right arrows. So MIDI bus number one. You click and then go to track number two. The same thing, you long tap on track number two. You set the MIDI bus to two. Now, what we can do is go into audio layer. So let's turn Fugue Machine off a second. And then go to routing, input, and then choose Helium output one, right? So now this is going to get MIDI from Helium. Right? So now for the bass, what we can do obviously is go to Helium obviously and in track number two, as I said earlier, we have this bass note and then we, we need to put the so we have this bass note and we need to put the the bus to track to two right and then go to track number three now in cubases go to routing input choose um helium output two so now all together sounds like this So basically, this is a workaround for um, the limitation in Cubasis. So now, Helium supports up to um, 16, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, is it going to show in here? But anyway, it does support up to 16. There is a way to, uh, you need to activate that somewhere. But anyway, once you activate all the 16 bosses in Helium, and you restart Helium, Cubasis does show you all 16 
uh, output, right? So you can choose them as input. And yeah, so that's a simple way of routing media in Cubasis 3. And obviously we can also have a um, Fugue Machine on track number two playing its own thing, right? So whatever thing, so whatever MIDI effect you have on track two is still going to play once you enable uh, MIDI through. And it's also going to let the, the, the MIDI from any other track come through. So yeah, that's, that's it guys. That's for MIDI routing in Cubasis 3. Okay, so that's it for MIDI um routing uh yep see you on the next one